In this video, I'll show you how the RS232 test project works. iDron have produced an interface test project like this for most of the interfaces to help test existing projects, but also to show how data can be transmitted and received. The project loads up and shows an introduction page which shows the necessary connections as well as a pinout of the relevant connector. You can then open a setup page or the terminal page. In the setup, you can adjust parameters so that these match the device you are connecting it to. You can reset the parameters back to default by pressing the default button. You must press save before exiting to ensure changes are made. In the terminal view, you can type commands to send or alternatively save commands to variables to make send and set messages easier in the future. To save to a variable, press save, then click on the variable you wish to save to. When you send a message, the TX will highlight and display the sent message. When the module receives valid data, the RX will highlight and you can see the received data. You can then switch between the RX and TX pages by pressing the respective text. This project, as well as many others, can be found on the iDron TFT website under Projects.